maybe you've seen the Smart Folders option in the Notes app on your iPhone or iPad, but have no idea what it does or how to use them. Smart Folders is relatively new as of iOS 15. This feature allows note users to quickly put notes in Smart Folders by adding tags inside their notes. Tags can make your life easier by rapidly putting your desired notes in a particular folder for easy access. All of the notes that contain a specific tag appear in one place in a smart folder. Thanks for joining me on this week's Ellen's Tips for iOS, where I help seniors master their iPhones and iPads. If you find value in the video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and turn on that notification bell so you never miss when a new video is posted. Let's get started. Let's start by creating our first uh, smart folder. So to do that, we'll come into the Notes app. We'll make sure that we're in the folder section. We'll come down to the lower left corner and click on New Folder. And I'm going to choose New Smart Folder. Now I have to give the smart folder a name. I'm going to call it Vacation. And now we need to give it a tag. So I'm going to create a new tag and just call it vacation. When I do that, when I hit return, you'll see that that tag pops up into the tag uh, area and it's highlighted. You can add as many tags as you want to this particular folder. So, you know, uh, there's a lot of things that you can do with tags and any uh, note that has this particular tag on it is going to get added to that folder and I'll show you that in a minute. But right now I'm going to go ahead and tap on done and you'll see that our new folder uh, has been created but it has a little bit of a different uh, look to it because it's a smart folder so instead of just a regular folder you're seeing a cog wheel next to that folder. You can also create uh, a new smart folder in the tag section. So if I scroll to the bottom, you'll see uh, a list of the tags that I have right now. And if I tap on uh, any of these tags, so I'm just going to tap on Amazon right now, it also is going to find the notes that may have that tag uh, associated with them. And if I hit the more icon in the upper right corner, there's an option there to create smart folder. So I can go ahead and tap on that and it already is going to give a name to that because of the Amazon uh, note that's inside there. I can go ahead and tap on save. And so if I come back to the folders area, you'll see that Amazon is listed there and it has one note in it because there was a note that had a tag already associated with Amazon. We can also convert any folder to a smart folder. And to do that, I'm going to use this uh, folder called store list. I'm going to go ahead and open it. I'm going to choose the more icon in the upper right corner. And if I scroll to the bottom, it'll say convert to a smart folder. I'm going to go ahead and tap on that. A pop-up will appear and it says store list will be added to each note. Um, it should say in this folder and the folder will be turned into a smart folder. And then there's a, a, a at the end it says this can't be undone. So once you convert it to a smart folder, you can't convert that folder back to a regular folder. I'm going to go ahead and convert it. And when I come back to the folders area, you'll see that store list has become a smart folder. If I tap on store list, you'll see that each of these notes has the tag store list attached to it. And if I come back to the folder section and scroll to the bottom where the tags are, you'll also see that store list has been added as a tag. Let me show you how to add a tag to a note so that it ends up in uh, one of the smart folders that we created. So I'm going to go ahead and just tap on 
uh, all iCloud because I've already created the note. And I created a note that says, you know, 2022 vacation plans, but I haven't added a tag to it yet. We also have a smart folder called vacation. So I'm going to go ahead and open that note. And then in the notes area, I'm going to add the hash symbol, which is this symbol. And as you can see, the tags that we've created are already listed above the keyboard area. I can go ahead at this point and choose vacation and it pops up into that note and you can see that it's yellow, meaning it it's spelled the same exact way as it is in the tags uh, options area. If I were to spell that with a small v, it would remain gray and wouldn't show up. Because I have it uh, correctly uh, spelled with the correct same hashtag, if I hit done, you'll see when I come back into the folders area that that note has been added to that vacation folder uh, because we used the appropriate tag. To edit a smart folder, all you need to do is push and hold on the smart folder, I'll go ahead and do store list, and you'll see where it says edit smart folder. I can go ahead and tap on that, and here I'm just going to have a few options. I can change the name if I want, or I can add a new tag, or create a new tag, whatever I choose. When I'm finished, I'll just go ahead and tap on done. To delete a smart folder, you can do that and you won't lose the notes inside of that folder. Let me show you how that works. So if I take the store list and I swipe to the left and it says delete, I'm going to go ahead and tap on the trash can. And you'll see here, deleting this smart folder won't affect its notes. So the notes are going to remain in wherever you put them. If they're in iCloud, will go back to iCloud. So let me show you how it works. I'm going to tap on delete smart folder. There were four uh, notes in that folder. If I tap on all iCloud, which my folder uh, where my notes are stored, you'll see that those four, Amazon, Best Buy, B&H Photo, and Giant Eagle remain in iCloud. All I did was delete the folder. Tag support was a much requested feature from Apple's Notes users and those who wanted to switch from platforms like Evernote. Now that the feature resides inside the operating system, Apple Notes is one of the best free note-taking apps available. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.